There is also an increased demand for emergency contraceptives now that Roe v. Wade is overturned. Some pharmacies are starting to put limits on Plan B pills. Eyewitness News reporter Jasmine Peyu spoke with a local pharmacist and has that part of our coverage tonight. Shock. Um, a sense of despair and really just overwhelm. It's a domino effect spurred by the overturning of Roe v. Wade. Demand for Plan B has it flying off shelves across the country. I wasn't surprised that, that there would be a shortage of the Plan Bs because I thought people would kind of panic. While there isn't a shortage yet, pharmacies say they're preparing for the possibility. On Monday, both CVS and Rite Aid limited purchases of emergency contraception to three pills per customer. Tuesday, CVS removed the limit. They want to take care of as many people as they can. They don't want somebody to buy 20 of them or something like that. So. I might actually limit if you try to buy 20, but as far as coming in, if you need it, I see that I'll, I'll sell it. Jerry Martin is the owner and pharmacist here at Linsky's Pharmacy on South 2nd Street. His store carries the Plan B pill. About $53. In the days following the Supreme Court's decision, some rushed to social media urging people to stock up on the pills. Definitely has gone viral as far as people just really wanting to find a different way to support. Um, but really, us organizing in a strategic way, I think, would be a better way for us to do this. And while abortion and contraception are legal here in Pennsylvania, some say that could change. I am fearful because it just feels like people are trying to take advantage of a situation that people should be rising up and like come together about. Martin says he has plenty of the emergency contraception left for anyone who needs it. Reporting, Jasmine Payu, CBS 3 Eyewitness News. And there's more to come.